So after two hours, I came back, and the baby was still lying there. Eventually, I got her with me, and I did try to contact a lot of vets, but I could not find anyone. I am a doctor. I know I know everything about human body, but birth, I had no idea. I had to study a lot, and I just started taking care of muffins. Step by step, muffins started growing. She was a very healthy bird. Then she was super friendly. Hello, my snuggly muffin. Muffin likes to snuggle. See? Mwah. She started taking small, small flights. She only likes to be around humans. Okay. So we used to go out on walks. She used to love to go out. But one day we had an unfortunate incident. She got caught by a pet dog. She was okay, but she got so scared. She got scared of flying, and she started shedding her feathers. Say hi to Ria. Say hi. She looked like Voldemort. So we all used to call her Little Voldemort in our house. After three months of struggle, Muffin started gaining her feathers back. It took her about five months to start flying again. She's a very strong girl. She fought, and she actually was blessed with life twice. Not kept her caged or anything. She has an option. If she wants to fly away, she can go. She chooses not to go, so she's choosing to be with us. And she's just like a little dog. She has to be with everybody. We are more careful. She loves to sit with us, travel with us. Wherever we go, we take her with us only. She's more spoiled than me. My parents have pampered her more than they have pampered me or my brother. She cannot survive without attention. No. Mm. Always it. I always had a companion with me. So much love to offer. So happy to have her in my life.